Hey everybody, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Oh. Whatever time of day you're watching today, Sasha here. It's Friday, so you know what that means. It's another episode of the continuation of the month of hot tea celebration. Day 10. We're in the double digits now, y'all. So, again, it's mystery box time for Republic of Tea. Okay, so we have Organic Mint Fields. Certified Organic Round Herb Tea Bag. So, let's see. Of course, it says, enjoy this environmentally friendly, round, unbleached tea bag free of wasteful strings, staples, and tags. And of course, we have a um, um, note from the Minister of Leaves, which reads as follows. I am a partner with change, moving every moment to make union with all things. Nothing happens to me. Things happen, quoted the Minister of Leaves. Instructions are as follows. Steep tea bag for five to seven minutes using boiling water. We're on that. Um, the free catalog again. It is one eight hundred two nine eight four T T E A. And the website is www.republicatea.com. Ingredients are as follows: organic spearmint organic peppermint and organic lemon balm and it's certified USDA organic what is this other one? Oh, quality assurance international certified organic that's pretty neat and certified gluten free so let's open this bad boy up and see if it's really a field of mint Yeah, well, definitely get spearmint, peppermint, maybe a little bit of that lemon balm. Ooh, y'all, at least it is Friday. Thank goodness it's Friday. I have to get back. I'm getting, turn this off. I have to get back into town and, um... Yeah, I'm just, I got all my stuff rounded up so I can easily just get out of on out of here. And, um, yeah. Of course, I hate the fact that I took so long to, um, make this video. Like, I fell asleep. I was really tired, y'all. <sighs> yeah, today at work was... It was okay, but um, now it's like the wheels are set in motion, even though we're still training. So, Alrighty, folks, don't go anywhere. I'll be right back with the tea ready brewed and ready to be sipped and evaluated for you all. We're back, folks. Tea is ready brewed. And yeah, let's go ahead and have a sip. I am kind of curious, even though I can kind of tell what it tastes like from the title, name of the tea, rather. Uh, this is Organic Mint Fields. Unsweetened. Cheers, y'all. Keep searing my tongue. Yeah. <laughs> so I get like. A <laughs> I 
if I got lick uh hot iron, hot clothing iron. Mmm. So, despite, you know, me burning my mouth, initially it tastes like an ordinary mint tea, a caffeine-free mint tea. I get more spearmint than peppermint, and if the ingredients were, as I remember, there is more spearmint than peppermint. I do get a little bit of the lemon balm at the end. This lemon present, this lemon presence. So, you know, I mean, it is. It, it has its unique twist. This mint fields, but it just ends up tasting like a average, ordinary herb tea. So. I what the hey, right? This is my last night here. Let's go ahead and try to sweeten this, see if we get a different kick out of it than um having it unsweetened. This is liquid stevia. I'll give it a nice little squirt. And give it a little swish, y'all. Woo! If ever a time that I was glad it was Friday, <laughs> it's today. It's right now, because boy, howdy. After being out of, like, legit work for so long, it feels different. It feels good, because I'm, you know, getting back into the swing of things, getting back to my former glory, but, you know, I just got to build myself back up to it. Alright. So now it's definitely incorporated with those swishes I was giving the cup. This is organic mint field sweetened with a little bit of stevia from Republic of Tea. Cheers, y'all. The sweetness really helps the mint come out more. Because I initially get that taste of spearmint and then peppermint uh, follows afterward. But not so much lemon balm anymore. Which, you know, it doesn't really sway me negatively, but... I kind of missed the lemon balm. Yeah. Interesting. So, folks, cutting it close again. <laughs> I gotta hurry up. So, it's verdict time, y'all. And in the case of Republic of Tea's Organic Mint Fields, out of my rating scale of good, okay, bad, First, we'll do unsweetened. Um, unsweetened, I would give it... I'd give it an okay. This is okay. I mean, it tastes more or less like um, your average run-of-the-mill tea. I mean, it does have a kick with the lemon balm. But... Um, you know, like, I, 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 I get this with, um, I could probably get this with other organic teas that I can get, organic mint teas, or just mint teas in general, that I can get at my local grocer, um, or department store, or whichever. Now, when it comes to sweetening this tea out of my rating scale of good, okay, bad, um, I would give it... A good. 
it you know it, interestingly enough it brings out the minty really because there's more spearmint than peppermint like peppermint tea can do like I find it better if it's unsweetened but this one is spearmint driven and I guess with spearmint and a sweetness a touch of sweetness to this it really brings out that clean minty taste which you know I ain't complaining about it it just sucks that the lemon balm seems to disappear <laughs> when there's um, a sweetness, a touch of sweetness to this in my experience. Would I get this tea as a solo tin? Mm, probably a traveler's tin. Not a full size like 36. Um, tea bag tin or 50 tea bag tin, depending on what kind of tea you're dealing with. But maybe for a traveler's tin, definitely would get a bit more of this tea. Um, see if I could like try it, um, try it a, 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 a different way or if I can have it. Again, I'm not having this tea like my usual um, concentrated tea, I'm having this kind of, like, either normal or diluted, so. Yeah, I mean, it's okay tea. It's an okay tea, but it's, um, it could be better if, um, it could be better if maybe I had it, uh, concentrated or, you know, if that lemon balm didn't disappear when I tried, when I sweetened this tea. So, folks, with that being said, that's going to do it for this episode of Month of Hot Tea Celebration. Uh, I hope you enjoyed watching as much as I enjoyed making it. Any questions, comments, suggestions, or small talk, don't be a stranger. Leave it in the comment section below. Any and all are welcome. Greatly appreciated. Love to hear your thoughts and opinions. Um, for the question of the video, I guess, what's your favorite kind of tea? Um, what's your favorite kind of mint tea, I should say? Um, yeah, let me know the name of the tea and the company behind it. I, I do really like a good mint tea and, um, it's, it's not hard to find, like, mint's kind of common, too, since, you know, a lot of people can't tolerate caffeine, so I'd love to hear your thoughts and opinions on it so I can, like, maybe get a good lookout for what to try next, and, um, yeah, that'll be fun. So, folks, I bid you adieu. I have to get on the road tomorrow, and, um, yeah, just get on back home for the weekend and uh rest and enjoy myself until monday rolls around the corner y'all <laughs> but yeah thank you very much again for watching can never thank you enough this is sasha signing off take care take it easy make it a great day today and every day and i'll see you until the next video so until then my friends Bye now.